Hello, and welcome to Where the Wild Things Read. I'm SF Hardy, children's librarian and author of Dancing Monkeys in My Soup. Today, I'm going to read a special story to you. Halloween Monster by Katherine Stock. Halloween Monster. It's a cold morning. I pull my jacket tight. A gust of wind snatches my cap and whisks it over the fence. Hold on to your hats tight. Next door, my friend Billy is helping his dad rake up leaves. Come help us, he calls. We sweep up all the leaves into a big pile and then we jump into the middle. Have you ever dived into a pile of leaves? It's a lot of fun. We squash the leaves into big plastic bags. Then we have some mugs of cider. Halloween is tomorrow, says Billy. All the monsters and witches and ghosts will be out. Want to come trick-or-treating with us? Asked Tommy's dad. Tommy doesn't look too happy about going trick-or-treating. After lunch, we buy some pumpkins. Billy and I scrape out all the seeds. Then we draw faces on the pumpkins for Mom and Billy's dad to cut out. You can draw faces on your pumpkins too. Mom roasts the pumpkin seeds with some salt in the oven. They are warm and crunchy. Billy says he's going to be a pirate when he goes out trick-or-treating. What about you, asked Billy. Nothing, I say. I'm not going. That night, I looked under my bed. No monsters there. I checked the closet. No ghosts there. I get under the covers. Something sits on my bed. A witch! I jump up, but it's only mom. I don't want to go trick-or-treating with Billy, I say. I'm scared of monsters and ghosts and witches. There are no monsters or ghosts or witches, mom says. And she kisses me. Mwah. Just little children all dressed up. Oh, I say. The next day is Halloween. Mom makes me a monster suit with a long tail. Then we make a mask with big teeth. Someone's at the door. Trick or treat! Shouts a pirate. Roar! Roars a monster with a long tail and big teeth. He gives the pirate some candy and follows him out the door. I thought that you didn't want to come trick or treating with us, says the pirate. Tommy didn't want to go, but I do, says the monster. The end. Thank you for joining us on Where the Wild Things Read. Until next time, bye.